Hello friends, this is your Patriot, John Adams, making another video for Trillion Dollar Silver. Today we're going to be talking about the continuing rise in the Bitcoin price and how you should probably take some of your profits off the table. I don't necessarily think that this is the top. I do think we're going to be going up a little bit farther. There could be a small pullback similar to these. And we can, you know, make another steeper gain here. So we're not going straight up, it doesn't look like yet, but we're definitely close. I mean, this could be the top. So I would at the least take 50% um, of all your Bitcoins off the table if you bought in back where I advised to. Well, that was right there. So if you listened to what I said three weeks ago, you could have made about 100% gains. Um, I don't actually personally have any money to be able to invest in this, but I'm trying to use my mathematical skills. I do have a degree in a bachelor's degree in mathematics, a double major <clears throat> in statistics and operations research. So it does help me understand what's going on. So I'm trying to apply my knowledge and you know let people realize that I do know what's going on and hoping that one day I can maybe get a job or make this business work out. So you know if you got if you know anybody with mathematical related jobs, I could definitely use it and you'd be helping the Patriot movement. But yes, it does look like we have made some significant gains in Bitcoin. There could be pullbacks anytime now. This is a very volatile asset and it does appear to kind of be leading gold and silver now. So you could possibly use Bitcoin as a uh, predictor of future gold and silver prices. I mean clearly this is um this depends on the internet. So if something happens to the internet, that correlation could totally erode between Bitcoin and gold and silver. If we look at the more accurate charts, you can see that it did have like a little straight up period here from about 280 to 320. What this is doing to silver, silver still seems to be waiting. It is about to spring up. I would say with almost certainty that we're going to see some large gains. It's going to be something like this and then back down up like that for a little bit. And then one day we're going to have another one of these. So you need your gold and silver, you need your Bitcoin, but you have to be paying severe attention if you want to be holding on to Bitcoin just because it's so incredibly volatile. Like, this is the larger chart. Yeah, so this has only been like three or four years here. Going from $20 to 200 so back down to 80 and now we're up into the 300 plus range. So, I mean, just look at the average direction that this thing's heading. It's exponential in a positive, you know, way, at least for the time being. And there's not that many people in the population using Bitcoin, so it could get much, much higher. Please be aware of Bitcoin. Get your silver. What else do we got? Follow me on Trillion Dollar Silver or at on my Twitter at Trillion Dollar Silv. This one's starting to get uh, a lot more followers doing pretty well but they could always take it all away so also be sure to check out trillion if um, I ever happen to disappear you can look for me there hope to see you guys soon take care